Okay, okay. So let's do let's do there our last challenge of the day. This one is called verify. Verify. People keep trying to trick my players with imitation flags. I want to make sure that they're getting the real thing. I'm going to provide a SHA-256 hash and the decrypt script to help you know what my flags are legitimate. Okay, we can download the flat download the challenge files over here. So this one is uh, this was a more complicated challenge than um, well, especially at the easy level. But uh, let's go over to our web shell. And this was called Verify. Okay, so when we download the file, it's going to uh, download this challenge.zip file. And then when we unzip the file, it's going to create a bunch of different directories under the home directory. For instance, so it's going to be CTF player, home CTF player and then drop in and then there's ah okay there's the uh, decrypt script over here and then there's the checksum file so let's navigate to that directory so home slash ctf player slash drop in okay and then we have the decrypt script we have the checksum so the checksum is um this is the SHA-256 value that we have to compare the other files against to, to determine which one is the, uh, the legitimate file. And then we have the decrypt script, and we can, we can uh, cap that out. So this, this is the script that's going to verify whether or not, whether or not the, uh, the file that we're scanning is the legitimate one or not. And inside of the files directory, we have a bunch of different files right here. Okay, so manually scanning each one of these is going to take a long time. What we need to do is we need to SHA-256 sum. We need to run SHA-256 sum on, um, on all of these files right here to get their SHA-256 uh, hash values. And we need to compare them against this uh, this checksum file right here. So what we can do is we can we can get the checksum value first. So this is the checksum value. We can copy that, and then we can run. What was it that we need to run? We need to sha. 256 sum against file the uh, the file in the files directory and we want to run it against every file which we can do by indicating the uh, the asterisk wildcard right here and for for the output right there we want to grep we want to grep out the uh, the value that we're looking for which is this right here so it's going to, we're going to run the uh, the hash, the SHA-256 hash function on all the files. And then for each one, we're going to compare it with this value right here, which is the legitimate value. And the output should, um, should tell us which file is the legitimate one. So we run, the, so we run this command and it hits against this file right here. So, which means that this is probably the file that we're looking for. So we can run the um, the decrypt script. Oops. Decrypt. Okay, so let's do decrypt.sh, and then we run it on this file right here. Oops. Okay, and let's see what happens. 
Okay, it says it's not a valid file, but uh, but I, I assure you that this is the correct file right here. So it's not gonna it's not going to work here. We have to go into the we have to use it uh, from the server. So we can launch the instance. So inside of the challenge window, we can launch the instance, and then what we need to do is connect to. We're going to connect to the uh, to the server via SSH. Uh, with uh, with this particular this particular password, so copy that and then SSH into the server. Type yes and then provide the password. The password is over here. Okay, now we're logged in. Okay, so, but we actually know which file is the correct file over here. It's this one. So we can copy this, and then we can run the decrypt script. So when we run this, it should give us the flag. Okay, let's try it out. LS dash R. Hmm. So let me let me just uh, make sure that the that the file we're looking for is in here. We're going to find find name equals to. So we're looking for name, sorry. Huh, maybe it is a, maybe it's a different one. Okay, okay, so we're going to run the same thing again. So check some and cat it out. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to copy our value right here. And then we're going to 256 sum. What was it? Ah, SHA-256. Okay, so, oh, it's a different file name. It's a different file name between the sample and what, the, what they give over here. Okay. Okay, so decrypt. .sh, decrypt.sh file name. Okay, so decrypt.sh, and we know it's this file right here. So copy that, and then paste that in. Okay, so this works. So we got the flag for this particular challenge. We can copy that, and whoops, we need to copy the whole thing. All right, copied, and we can get out of here with the exit command and we can go back to Pico CTF verify and submit that as the flag. Uh, we submit we submit this um, this flag right here. click submit. okay and then if we haven't already we can click on the like button over here to verify that uh, so, to sorry to um, to show our appreciation for the Challenge makers. Hey there, hacker frogs.
Are you enjoying this workshop? Learning new concepts and skills? If so, there's a way you can support the channel. And it's totally free. Just click on the subscribe button below the video. Also, click on the like button. And if you have questions or comments on this workshop, please leave them below the video. Thanks for listening. And now, back to our scheduled programming.